Welcome everyone, Dr. Mandel here. I'd like to share a simple technique that I've been using on patients for several decades. This technique is going to keep you healthier. We're going to be working with specific areas within the cranium, within the skull. By applying pressure to certain regions within our skull, we're going to increase movement, increase function. That means we're going to stimulate the CSF, the cerebral spinal fluid. The cerebral spinal fluid is what surrounds the brain and spinal cord. This fluid transports nutrients, hormones, and peptides. It removes metabolic waste and toxic substances. The cerebral spinal fluid around the brain and spinal cord has a pumping mechanism, which is directly connected with our central nervous system, communicating with all parts of our body. From all these accumulated stresses that we developed over time, physically, chemically, as well as emotionally, these joint structures can fixate. And when they do so, it will affect the cerebral spinal pump, which can lead to many different kinds of symptoms. So we want to apply movement into these fixated or locked areas within the skull. And when we do so, we have better function, better movement, and ultimately better health. So let's briefly look at the anatomy of these eight cranial bones. They all have unique shapes. You have the frontal bone, the parietal bones, the temporal bones, the occipital bones, the sphenoid, as well as the ethmoid bone. The cranial bones are held together by unique joints called sutures, which are made of thick fibrous connective tissue. They are irregularly shaped, allowing them to tightly join with all the uniquely shaped cranial bones. Those bones are bound together by Sharpie's fibers. And because these are synarthrosis joints, which means there's not a lot of movement between them, that fibrous tissue will allow a tiny amount of movement that is permitted at those sutures. What you are gonna love is that while doing this technique with me, you're going to feel the many different physiological changes immediately. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna contact our heels of our hands right above our ears. You can bring your fingers directly over your head like this. Now what I want you to do, we're going to push in nice and firmly, and we're going to push back as we push in and hold it there for a second or two, then go forward. And that's gonna be one repetition. Go ahead, push in and back, and push in and forward, that's two. We're gonna do five of these. Now as you go back, you'll feel behind your nose, those sinuses opening up, go forward. Push in, push back and in, hold it. Push in, forward, that's four. Push back and in, and push forward, good. When you push in, we are putting movement along the temporal bones of our skull, increasing neural stimulation to the brain. So when you feel any type of changes, it could be sinus, breathing better, less pressure, uh, feeling where your head feels lighter. This is all the physiological changes you're going through right now by applying that movement. Now let's continue with the second part. Again, five full repetitions. We'll contact the same area hands over the head, push nice and firmly. And this time you're gonna push up and hold it for a second or two. You'll feel a lightning behind your nasal area and push down, okay? Push up, down, that's two. Up, I feel a lot of lightning behind my skull and my eyes, go down, three. Push in and up. And many of you are gonna feel all different kinds of symptoms. That is perfectly normal. And last one, push in and up. Good, I feel a lot of lightning. Push in and down. This next part is very powerful. We're going to be working with the vertex of the head. We're going to put our fingers together, put both of our hands right over the top of our head, pretty much aligned directly with our ear. If we take a imaginary line and draw it up, just like this. Take those fingers, put it right over it, push down firmly. Now what I want you to do here, we're gonna do five repetitions, full repetitions, forward and backwards, but this time we're gonna push 
down and forward. Good, you'll feel it right behind your facial area and go back. Push down and forward. We're putting a lot of movement in the cranial area and push back. This area is very sensitive, very powerful. Down and forward, push down and back. That's three. Down and forward, and you'll see what I'm talking about when you're doing this, and down and back. Last one, push down and forward, right there, right behind my eyes. Push down and back. And the last part, we're going to work with the back of the skull, called our occipital region. The upper part of the neck, as well as the lower skull. It's a very vital, important area. Many nerves back in here go directly into the brain. They go over the head behind the eyes, affecting the eyes. They affect the ears. You can get tinnitus, ringing of the ears, vertigo, dizziness, visual changes, facial sinus problems. By just correcting this area, those conditions can diminish significantly. So we're going to take our fingers and put them together. We're going to apply it on the upper neck, lower skull area, right below the skull. Cross your fingers, put it right up against there and push it firmly like this. That's gonna be our contact right here. Get in there and push it firmly against it. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna push up and then we're gonna push down. That's one, push in and up. As you push up, you'll feel the frontal part of your facial area, those sensations change and go down. Push in and up, good, and go down. That's three. Push in and up, push in firmly and push up. Don't be afraid to pull it up. And then push in and push down, that's four. Push in, up, go ahead, come on. And push in and down. I am certain that most of you will definitely feel some type of physiological change while doing this technique, you are increasing mobility within the cranium, stimulating the cerebrospinal fluid pump, affecting your central nervous system, which is controlling your entire body. Do this technique as often as necessary. You will see great changes. Please share this with your friends and family. Leave your comments below, and most important, Make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.